tear downs from the track. The county says it hopes to have most of it done in the next six to eight weeks. In just a few hours, some closures will open up back along the strip. Sands is down to one lane in both directions from Las Vegas Boulevard to Koval, and two lanes of southbound Las Vegas Boulevard are closed from Harmon to Sands. Those closures run until 9 o'clock tonight. And culinary workers celebrated a major victory today, ratifying their new contract with Wynn. There's coming at virtually the same time unions across the country are inking historic deals. So is 2023 the year of the union? UNLV law professor Ruben Garcia has an answer in tonight's Fox 5 experts. A lot of it is just timing. Um, when the contract expires, uh, the no strike clause of the contract also expires. And so that's uh, it just it happens to be this year. A lot of them were timed to expire in 2023, and then they, when they renewed, it's another five years that the, there can't be any strikes or walkouts or anything. Garcia teaches law at UNLV. He has a labor background. You can hear more of our conversation tonight on Fox 5 News at 6, and the full interview can be found on fox5vegas.com. Just click on the Experts tab. Live look at the Big Apple tonight, and they are certainly getting into the holiday spirit with those lights. The day before Thanksgiving is one of the busiest travel days of the year. As we've said, with the FAA expecting nearly 50,000 flights to take off today alone. So let's check in with Sam with a look at the forecast. Smooth sailing across southern Nevada, so any flights coming in and out looking good. Also, for people driving in and out of Las Vegas ahead of Thanksgiving tomorrow, the weather is cooperating. A few high clouds, that's about it. We'll see a little more cloud cover overnight into your Thanksgiving morning tomorrow, but no rain. We are locked in a very dry pattern. Temperatures fall back into the 50s through the evening tonight with those overnight lows on their way into the 40s and 30s tomorrow morning. Thanksgiving forecast on our way into the mid-60s with increasing sunshine during the afternoon. But we're locked in a dry pattern and looking at the latest drought monitor for southern Nevada still in a moderate to severe drought around Clark County with even an extreme drought for parts of Nye County. I'm not seeing any rain in our seven day forecast, but when we do see rain in the forecast, one thing that can help enhance rain or snow is cloud seeding. Fox 5's Kim, Pass Kim Passoff has been reporting on this here in Southern Nevada, Kim, and you actually had a chance to see it in person. Yeah, that's right. There are three cloud seeders up in the Spring Mountains. They target passing winter storms, trying to get more rain and snow out of them. We got to see the seeder on Mount Potosi. It specifically targets Red Rock Canyon. It was the idea of the group Save Red Rock, who raised $100,000 last fall to pay for it. Operated remotely by a team of scientists in Reno, it shoots a solution into passing clouds. So we can create this ice in clouds that wouldn't typically have the ice. The simplest way to explain it is it just increases the ability of the clouds to create precipitation. So how much of a difference can one machine make and why is the state now paying for this program? We'll have those answers for you coming up tonight at 11. It's a big tradition around the holidays for people to get together with their family and their friends. Heidi Hansen's tradition continues this year of flying about 2,300 miles from Alaska to Las Vegas with one mission in mind, to help the homeless. Fox 5's Joe Vigil shares her story. Good morning. Yep, have a good day. <laughs> You're welcome. Heidi Hansen from Soldatna, Alaska doesn't typically tell people who she is, where she's from. Good morning. Good morning, how are you? Good, have a nice day. There's so much. You're very welcome. Or why she's here when handing out care packages with food and warm clothing to people along the strip. Some will never even know she was there, quietly dropping off items while making sure people are still breathing. You don't want to find him not breathing, especially, I mean, like that. So I looked and I could see that he was breathing. Good morning. Her anonymity is just her style, her way to help the homeless on the strip. 15, 17 years ago, my ex committed suicide by cop down here. He moved from Alaska here. I brought my car to him. He lived in it. So he ran the streets with crazy alcoholism. After it happened, Hansen said she started living again. That's when I turned my life around and decided it was time to help people in a more positive way. Good morning. 
There's a snack and a hat and some gloves for you. So for the last six years, this is how she spent the holidays, trying to give back to others who struggle. Stomach-wise, that's food, that's sugar, that's carbohydrates, that's protein that will keep me going through the day. I wish more people would do stuff like that because it's stressful. I have my whole house in my backpack right now. So I just, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just really grateful. And then I said, hey, I said, here's a new pair of socks for your feet. And he's like, oh my gosh, thank you. So, I mean, just simple as socks because you could see the blisters on his feet. Do you get sad? Oh, yeah. Last yeah. night I was bawling. Did that right there? That makes my heart sad because she's probably 70, 75, and she shouldn't be out here. I mean, literally, I said, good morning, and then handed it to her. I mean, that's that right there is touching. And while people here may never know Heidi's name, they may remember that one day someone stopped by with a little food, warm clothing, and cared enough to say, Good morning. Good morning. Have a nice day. Well, thank you. You're welcome. Jovi Hill, Fox 5 News, local, yep. Las Vegas. Hanson says she plans to keep coming to Las Vegas each holiday as long as she is able to. Making a wish, Southern Nevada is making one 13-year-old boy's dream come true. They've made him a pilot for the day. Ben Hardigan from Reno, who's getting chemotherapy for lymphoma, learned today what it's like to take to the skies. That is uh, Legion Air's West Coast Training Center here in Vegas. Ben got to dress the part in a pilot's uniform, utilizing a cockpit simulator to feel what it's like being a real commercial airline pilot. Make-A-Wish Southern Nevada works closely with Allegiant Air. This is the first time the airline is able to fulfill a child's wish to be a pilot. To see this come to fruition and actually to get a wish in our pipeline for a kid who wants to be a pilot and being able to make that call to Allegiant was one of the proudest days I had as a president and CEO because I knew, as they always do, Allegiant would have our back. Make-A-Wish says Ben will be partnered with a pilot from Allegiant Airlines for the entire experience. Are you safe behind the wheel? When most red light violations tend to happen over Thanksgiving weekend. The Las Vegas Great Santa Run is back. Saturday, December 2nd. Register now for $10 off and join thousands of Santas at the downtown Las Vegas Event Center. Register now at fox5vegas.com. We love you, Las Vegas. This Take 5 to Care event is sponsored by Finley Subaru of Las Vegas and Landmark Recovery. First we grill it, then you dip it, and you dip it, and you dip it. Del Taco's new shredded beef birria grilled Cali combo burrito is grilled for peak toastiness and served with a savory consomme. Grab one today and say hello to Del Taco Better Mix. Details make the holidays. During the Genesis Signature event, lease the GV80 for $6.19 per month. Exclusively at Genesis of Las Vegas. When you save energy, you save money. Power Shift by NV Energy makes that easier for everyone. As a commercial or nonprofit customer, Power Shift empowers businesses with free and low cost products, services, and workshops to help get in on those savings. With free commercial smart thermostats and cashback incentives on energy-efficient equipment for new construction and renovations, it just makes good business sense. Find out about these and other PowerShift products and services at nvenergy.com backslash BES. Harbor Freight knows skill is important because on any given day, we're all mechanics, carpenters, fixers, DIYers, and training wheel taker offers. We also know no one should overpay for dependable tools to do the work, the building, the fixing, the DIYing, the training wheel taking offing. So whatever you do, do it for less at Harbor Freight. We're ready to deal at the Valley Auto Mall with new dealerships new technology, and even more new and pre-owned vehicles. All just minutes from where you are. Come make your best deal at the Valley Auto Mall for over 25 years. 
Good things happen when you put good things together. Shredded Beef Birria Rum from Del Taco. An absolute flavor bomb with noodly goodness. Try Birria Ramen today and say hello to Del Taco Better Mix. Traffic is flowing quite nicely for uh, the day before Thanksgiving. Live look at the 15 at Prim. However, the next few days mm. could be costly and dangerous for drivers. Yeah, a new report by Vera Mobility Corporation says the most red light violations during the holiday weekend happened the Wednesday before Thanksgiving today. Meanwhile, the most speeding violations happen on Thanksgiving Day. A cookbook for kids. What inspired a mom to help young children learn to be independent through cooking? The Las Vegas Great Santa Run is back. At the downtown Las Vegas Event Center. Register now at fox5vegas.com. We love you, Las Vegas! Investigate TV Plus. Weekday mornings at 11.30 on Fox 5. Black Friday starts now at Jerry Seiner Buick GMC on Centennial. Get Black Friday savings on new Sierra 4x4 starting at $42,999 at Jerry Seiner Buick GMC on Centennial. We keep this love in a photograph. We made these memories for ourselves. Where our eyes are never closing, our hearts are never broken, and time's forever frozen still. So you can keep me inside the pocket of your ribs. There are trucks, and then there's the GMC Sierra. Available with the connected driving experience. And the world's first six-function multi-pro tailgate. GMC Sierra. It's the truck. Or just announced just in time for Black Friday. Get 6,000 purchase allowance on select 2023 Sierra models when you trade in an eligible vehicle. That's 10% below MSRP. It's elementary. Budget Rent-A-Car Las Vegas has the premier fleet and elite vehicles you want. Hi, I'm Ella. And we've got the luxury you're looking for. A great selection of premier vehicles, from Escalades to Mercedes, even Teslas. Take it from me, Ella, at Budget. Finding the luxury you want is Ella Mentry. There are nine Budget locations throughout the Valley, online at BudgetLasVegas.com. It's Ella Mentry. Oh, what about this one? Love the timeless style. And the accent pillows. And the price? Do we go with the sofa or the love seat? I think I can help. That price is for the sofa and the love seat. Just $9.99 for both. And I've got many more combos under $1,000. Oh, oh my Bob. Bob. We don't have to choose a favorite. Just like our parents didn't have to choose a favorite daughter. Right. When every day is like Black Friday, there's only one thing to say. Oh my Bob. Bob's Discount Furniture. Black Friday starts now at Jerry Center Buick GMC on Centennial. Get Black Friday deals on new Buick Encore GXs. Save up to $32.50 off at Jerry Center Buick GMC on Centennial. Have a safe and happy Thanksgiving from your friends at Fox 5. Look at this trip on this Thanksgiving Eve. How fun is it to come out here and just chill out? Don't worry about the cooking. Eat at one of our fine restaurants and enjoy some chilly but nice weather, sunny weather out here. And then, if you live here in the valley, how nice is it to get to drive down to the Strip for the person who tells you at the very last minute <laughs> right. that they're in town? <laughs> well, at least F1's in the rearview mirror, so hopefully you're not waiting too long in traffic. Hopefully. Hopefully. The Golden Knights are back in action tonight in Dallas this time, closing out their five-game road trip before the Thanksgiving break. For those watching, there will be some familiar faces to the folks here in Vegas, including one who helped the guys in gold become champions just a few months ago. In a Fox 5 exclusive, Vince Apienza goes one-on-one -on -one with Stars assistant coach Misha Donskov. 
When Vegas makes their way in American Airlines Center and you look at the Dallas bench, it's almost like looking back in time at the 2021-22 Golden Knights coaching staff, head coach Pete DeBoer, assistant Steve Spott, and as of this season, Misha Donska. I caught up with a former Knights assistant to talk about his new opportunity. I love my time here. It's a world-class city, great organization. I loved every minute of it, and obviously, you know, with it culminating with the Stanley Cup, just special memories. Misha Donskov was a true day one Golden Knight. Before there was a team name or even a roster, he had every job imaginable, from scouting, analytics, to roster building, to youth clinics. He was even the face of VGKU, which was a hockey 101 class for fans new to the game. When he moved from the front office to the coaching staff, Donskov was the first one in the building helping injured players with their rehab assignments. He was also the last one out the door, getting the healthy scratches extra reps on the ice. Great relationships with the guys. Uh, I miss them a lot. You know, he, as a coach, you're in the trenches every day with the players. And the time I spent with the players, a lot of one on one time. Um, you know, certainly miss that. But the change has been really good. Uh, learning about a new team, a new group, a new city. Uh, I would certainly, you know, my time here, I'll always remember. And it's going to be a special place in my heart. After his contract ended with Vegas this past summer, an old friend in Pete DeBoer reached out. Pete and I actually knew each other before he had the opportunity in Vegas. We worked together uh, at Hockey Canada, fortunate enough to win a, a world championship in 2015. I was part of that staff. Pete was an assistant coach on that staff. So uh, we'd always had a, a special relationship and stayed in touch. Obviously, we coached together uh, in Vegas. Um, and, and to be back with him and Spotter has been really, really good. Great coaches, great people, and a world-class organization too in the Dallas Stars. It just felt like it was the right fit, the right time. Um, a new challenge, a new chapter, and uh, that was really kind of the basis of, of my thought process and the decision. Vince Sapienza, Fox 5 News Local, Las Vegas. Today, the NHL and Adidas unveiled the jersey the Vegas Golden Knights will wear during the upcoming Winter Classic. The jersey features vintage white as the primary color for the first time in franchise history and includes a V for Vegas as the jersey's crest. The Golden Knights will face off against the Kraken in the 2024 NHL Winter Classic on January 1st in Seattle at T-Mobile Park, home of the Major League Baseball team, the Mariners. A Georgia mom says her daughter inspired her to write a cookbook. It's also encouraged parents to let their young children become home chefs. Amanda Rose introduces us to the tiny chef. There you go. That's the sound of some hungry kiddos, but they're not waiting on mom to make their food. They're cooking it themselves. It's all thanks to this Kid de Cuisine cookbook written by Covington mom, Chanel Miller. It is to allow a kiddo as young as three, sometimes even younger, to feel that I can do it. I can be independent. I can be a big kid. And I can do things that I didn't know that I could do. At just four years old, Miller's own daughter, Hadassah, decided she wanted to be a chef. But Miller says there wasn't a cookbook out there to help her. So she created one. They are capable of doing big people things. And I think when we give them the ability to and the tools to, to do this, they surprise us. There are about 10 recipes in this cookbook. Each are about 30 minutes long. Miller tells me it's meant for the child to take the lead and work independently. Each recipe starts out with a title page and it goes into a cool short story. Of course, if your child can't read, Miller says the instructions have bright, beautiful pictures that demonstrate what to do. The book even comes with colored measuring cups, a hat and apron, and this kid-friendly knife. That's plastic, safe, you don't have to worry about any ouchies or ooies. That brings us to safety, something Miller says is top of mind. Many recipes even having this parent icon, meaning a parent has to help. We always want a parent to be present because kitchens can be dangerous places. Put your yogurt in your green cup. Even if your child isn't the next Gordon Ramsay, Miller hopes her cookbook instills independence and confidence. Good job. There you go. But most of all, Miller says it's about having fun. If we can learn and have fun and create as kids, like, you know, how boring would that be? 
Now, according to the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, uh, cooking together can be a fun way to teach your child valuable skills and promote good nutrition. Now, your local Las Vegas weather. 67 degrees are high this afternoon. We're going to keep the mid-60s rolling for Thanksgiving tomorrow, but for the holiday weekend, well, all bets are off. We've got some much colder air on the way, and we're about to feel the fall chill in the air by the time we get into the weekend. No rain chances on the way. This is the next seven days looking at rain chances. We are locked in a very dry pattern, but a storm will be getting a little bit closer with some rain and snow over northern Nevada and Utah, which will pull in some colder air for us. So temperatures are dropping for Saturday, Sunday. Highs back in the mid to upper 50s, and those mornings will get chilly with widespread 30s in Las Vegas. Now, tomorrow, not quite that cool, but tomorrow's temperatures will be the warmest we feel for the next seven days. We'll start out with some cloud cover for your Thanksgiving morning at 51 at 7 a.m. By noon, we're seeing the sun increase at 63, and then a very pleasant Thanksgiving, 66 the forecast high. Average is 64, so we're coming in just slightly above average for this time of year. And the wind, not an issue tomorrow. So smooth sailing for any outdoor plans you may have for Thanksgiving tomorrow. Uh, either side of 60 right now, we're at 53, cooling off a bit more in Pahrump. Boulder City's checking in at 55. As we head into the evening tonight, we'll be in the 50s through midnight with those overnight low temperatures on our way into the 40s and 30s with some cloud cover moving over us as we head into your Thanksgiving morning. Sunrise to sunset forecast will be in the 50s and 40s for most of the morning, popping up to 61 degrees by noon and then topping out in those mid 60s tomorrow across the valley. We go to 66 in Las Vegas, 72 in Laughlin with 64 degrees in Mesquite. So some cloud cover over California. That's what's drifting our way into the morning hours tomorrow with increasing afternoon sun. But point your attention, I want to point your attention to the top of the screen. We've got an area of low pressure, a cold storm coming in from the north. And you can already see this, 7 a.m. tomorrow morning, far northern Nevada getting in on some snow. That will be spreading into Utah tomorrow evening. All of this precipitation stays north of Las Vegas and southern Nevada. But if you are traveling maybe into far northern Nevada or up into Utah, up I-15 late tomorrow night and into Friday, this could certainly impact some travel from uh, pretty much Cedar City up to Salt Lake City tomorrow. As we go into the weekend, that's when the cooler air does drop south, and that brings us to the Fox 5 weather alert calendar. We've got the breeze picking up a bit on Friday, not talking about wind advisory criteria wind here, but gusts 20 to 30, and that's all a sign of the cooler air coming in. So a big weekend of football at Allegiant Stadium, UNLV and the Raiders at home. Cool and breezy for tailgating. We'll see those temperatures in the 50s. And then next week, our attention turns to some shower chances for that first weekend of December, uh, December 2nd and 3rd. We've got the Great Santa Run. We'll be watching that forecast closely next week. But in the meantime, it's just all about the cooler air coming in. We kick up the breeze with temperatures back in the mid-50s Saturday, Sunday. I want to point your attention to Sunday morning, 37. That's the morning start in Las Vegas, which means some neighborhoods around the Las Vegas Valley will be closer to freezing. So uh, definitely some colder air coming in by Sunday morning. We'll keep that hanging out for early next week with a high temperature of 60 on Wednesday. Take 5 to Care is sponsored by Finley Subaru of Las Vegas and Landmark Recovery. The Las Vegas Great Santa Runs returning on Saturday, December 2nd at a new location. It's the Downtown Las Vegas Event Center. It benefits Opportunity Village, and this Las Vegas tradition is getting ready to hit the streets again. If you register before November 28th, you can get $10 off. So go to fox5vegas.com, register now, get that discount. We'll be right back. This may look like a holiday shopping showdown, but it's a Nissan sales event ad. Get 2.9% APR financing for 60 months on road. Better hurry, these offers won't be back in stock. Shop Walker's Black Friday sale with hundreds of jaw-dropping doorbusters. Save up to 70% store-wide. Plus, get an additional 20% off hundreds of items. Save $400 on this stunning red sofa. Doorbuster price $299. Or get this five-piece dinette only $277. 48 months no interest financing with no money down. Plus, come join us for free hot dogs and soda. Nobody gives you more on Black Friday than Walker. Because I can't. There's never been a better time to get away with a great deal on the Hyundai you've always wanted. Plus, America's best warranty and up to three years complimentary maintenance. It's your journey. Own every mile at the Hyundai Getaway Sales Event. 
Now's the time to get in and get away. Get 0% APR for 60 months, plus zero payments for 90 days, or 2,500 bonus cash on the Hyundai Tucson. See your Las Vegas area Hyundai dealers. Guten Tag, this is my auto, and this is my key. And for all auto repairs, I only trust one place with my key. My key. Also pay in America. My key is so honest. And uh, what's the word? A transparent. Rock and roll. With e-inspection, I look at the photographs and see the problem and fix with my German eyeballs. Hey, you got some water damage. Wow. He's really good. I only trust mine key with mine key. At the all-new Centennial Volkswagen, it's Black Friday all month long. Drive a new Taos for just $199 or a new Tiguan for only $259. Plus, your first year registration is on us. Black Friday savings now at CentennialVolkswagen.com. This is the Fantasy Goat. It's the difference between being the greatest of all time or having a bad season. A complete disaster. <laughs> the Fantasy Goat. Sponsored by Casablanca. Blanca Resort and Casino, like Vegas used to be. This may look like a holiday shopping showdown, but it's a Nissan sales event to add. Get 2.9% APR financing for 60 months on road. Better hurry, these offers won't be back in stock. Las Vegas is home. We are local Las Vegas. Targeted ads might be finding you at 30,000 feet. The Wall Street Journal says United Airlines says it might start using passenger information to help brands serve targeted ads to customers. Some of the personalized ads could appear on United's seatback screens or on the app people use to book tickets at check-in. A record percentage of car loan applicants say they were rejected for loans this year. The survey from the New York Fed says an average of 11% of auto loan applicants were turned down. That tops the previous record of 7.9% in 2020. Also, fewer people were applying for loans. Heads up, if you do plan to shop this Black Friday, return policies at major stores have gotten even stricter since last year. 49% of retailers started charging fees to ship or restock returns. 40% have shortened the period of time customers have to return an item. The most common return window is seven days. So, sounds like you get to keep that present you really <laughs> wanted or loved. Yeah. Like that candle. Mm. A body was found in a metal drum burning in a fire. What police know so far. And the holiday travel rush continues. A look at the roads and the skies tonight. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the other side of the break for Fox 5 News at 6. Jack, the data shows that people love our more flavorful ultimate cheeseburgers. Show me the data. So the data's good. The data's real good. Well, honestly, it's the best data I've ever had. My best-selling ultimate cheeseburgers, seasoned as they grill. Harbor Freight knows skill is important because on any given day, we're all mechanics, carpenters, fixers, DIYers, and training wheel taker offers. We also know no one should overpay for dependable tools to do the work, the building, the fixing, the DIYing, the training wheel taking offing. So whatever you do, do it for less at Harbor Freight. Hurry to WSS for Black Friday deals. Now through November 27th, buy one and get one 50% off on select styles of footwear. From Adidas, Vans, Puma, Skechers, Celia, and Apre. Plus, buy one, get, get one 50% off. off on select styles of apparel and accessories. From WSS Athletic, Dickies, and New Era. Shop WSS in, in stores store or, or online. online. When you save energy, you save money. Power Shift by NV Energy makes that easier for everyone. As a commercial or a nonprofit customer, Power Shift empowers businesses with free and low-cost products, services, and workshops to help get in on those savings. With free commercial smart thermostats and cashback incentives on energy-efficient equipment for new construction and renovations, it just makes good business sense. Find out about these and other Power Shift products and services at nvenergy.com backslash BES. You've got a lot on your plate. 
SNWA is taking care of what's in your glass. Sourced from the Rocky Mountains, your tap water meets or surpasses the highest quality standards. Treated and tested using advanced technology and monitored around the clock, ensuring your hard, mineral-rich tasting water is safe to enjoy. Cheers to that, Southern Nevada. We're taking care of what's in your glass. I'm okay. SNWA is a not-for-profit water agency. That's a pretty tight spot. Watch this. Your Buick parks itself. That's so you. Of course you know where we're going. That's so you. It's kind of got a sixth sense. And a head-up display. They're here. At the heart of every Buick SUV is you. Get 1.9% APR. Plus, current eligible non-GM owners get up to $12.50 purchase allowance on 2023 Buick SUV models. Plus, no monthly payments until 2024. See your Southern Nevada Buick dealers. Right now at Jack in the Box, you can get two breakfast bagels with freshly cracked eggs and melty American cheese served all day. And they go great with my new boba milk tea. Get two bagels for just $4.50, which is a huge steal, but not like in an illegal way or anything. Fire crews respond to a valley fire and find a metal drum with a woman's body inside. What we know about this situation so far. And brand new details into kids who escaped from Desert Winds Hospital. That's coming up. Security cameras now monitoring this alley near Rancho High School where a teen was beaten to death on November 1st. We'll hear from neighbors who are still concerned for their safety. Temperatures slightly above average this afternoon, made it up to 67. We'll keep the mild weather going for Thanksgiving.